Hello everybody, today we're going to be reacting to the patch notes for... What, what even is it? It wasn't 3.1, it was a point zero. Three point one point zero with this... With, with this weirdo, with this, with this, with this guy, with this human. I don't know. I don't know what to call you. With this moth. There we go. That's, <laughs> that's that. That's a good one. Did a while to get you that. So just gonna be do, going through them. I've already looked at the weapons and the subs. I haven't seen the specials or anything else. So let's take a look. First change. Well, first major change. Uh, <laughs> splat vests have been changed. That's cool. Now. Uh, getting wins in the sneak peek and the percentage of votes and that's it are now less valuable and doing tricolor stuff is more valuable so there you go I th yeah I think that's a good change purely for the fact that it was like it was carrying some of the teams sometimes nobody cared about the tricolor did they really I mean, no, no, one, no one cared and now it means a lot more it's and got the most amount of value to it also the votes yeah they should really be lower like honestly yeah it's, it's just votes like this isn't a political party. Yeah, this isn't We're, a this freaking party. This isn't America. This isn't a popularity contest. Okay, Splattershot Nova! The movement speed is now 10% faster, which is always a good change, and the ink splatter will now fall around the enemy players... Not the enemy players. The players' feet. It, it, more it does make it more solid for just generally, like, be, can be a support weapon and you, thing. You can be a lot better movement-wise. I think you might be better at painting than the pro now, thanks to that. Like, it can turf more. Which means it could use more killer whale. Oh yeah. So that's cool. Could be more of a zones weapon. That's always nice to see. And it's a shooter that I don't hate, so that's good. Lunar Blaster! We don't know why this is getting a buff. I hate this buff. I do not know. It's, it's just worse Clash Blaster now. Increase the radius of the explosion area that deals 70 damage. Mm. By worse, I mean better. For the, for the record, I mean worse as in, like, better. But mm. it was already it was already better class to begin with. I'm not going to be safe behind walls now. Okay! Yeah, <laughs> it's a problem. Big swig! Let's go. I'm loving to see these big swig buffs. Let's do this! Adjusted, this is a good buff, actually. Adjusted the fall off rate based on vertical swing distance, making the amount of damage fall off gradually. Okay, so... Basically, the fall of damage is better, which means a big swig buff, which means I'm happy. That's basically. Think of it like, like think of it like Dynamo's buff, but instead of um distance, it's height. Okay, I'll take it. That's what it is because it's saying because it's saying that they adjust the fall of damage. It's the same process of what um Dynamo have to my knowledge <gasps> with vertical flex. Stipe right is the weapon now. Yep, I did get buffed. Sixty to sixty-eight damage. Do you know what this means? It means it deals 8 points more and does not shred nearly as much. I mean, it does shred a bit more. It could actually fight crab! <laughs> Happy claps. Let's go! Okay, Slosher. Adjusted the damage... Oh, it's the same thing. Yeah, it's the same. There's another thing with it. It's saying due to this change, the minimum amount of damage is turn up on is 50. I don't know if that's saying if it's now, like, it's now got a server spot or if it's... Still capable of hitting I'm pretty its sure it, it says minimum damage is 50. Hmm. I'm pretty sure it did have a sour spot. It was just quite hard to hit. It was really hard to hit. And that's... It's kind of the problem I have with sloshers. Mainly the ones that have the sloshing effect. Not like explosion or slosh machine. The ones that actually slosh and not shoot you with a bloody missile. Missile. Not missile. Mini! <laughs> Mini! <laughs> missile splatling! Increase the firing duration by 17%. My man, Mini is getting some buffs. You love to see it. Mini doesn't give much love. Uh, shorten the amount of time it takes for the player to be able to act after a dodge roll by... I mean, they're fast. This is negligible. The duelies are negligible. It's, hey. what, that's 600th of a second. This barely changes do? anything, but like... <laughs> this barely changes anything, but like... Yay. Yay! Cool. <laughs> Fast weapons are faster. Congratulations! Dabble doilies and spot doilies. You got a buff. Made the angle of diffusion narrower, depending on the amount of charge, making it easier. Oh! Okay. It's, it's like how, I think it's talking about like how it aims. That's good. It was it was unholy precise weapon. It it was that, yeah that it makes it more. It actually gives a more feature or more of a factor towards like actually fighting instead of being a missile spammer where you become a naval ship and you start throwing bombs on people. Mimmon speed will charge is about 10% faster. They're buffing all the charging stuff, which is good because it won't peep for missiles anymore. 
Great. And so far, a lot of these weapons that were given the weapon patches are specifically related to anything but shooters other than Nova, but Nova's kind of a crap weapon, so that's, that's fair. Good. That's good. That's good. These are all decent buffs. Roughly double the radius of the Ink Splatter. Again? Again? I'm scared to see this. They're, you're going to have like half of a burst bomb radius now. This is going to be fearful. Speaking of burst bomb, increase the amount of ink consumed from a standard ink tank from 40 to 45% if the player doesn't have the ink server sub ability equipped. The amount of ink consumed when the... Okay, so... Basically, it's increased, so now using burst bombs is a lot more expensive, and... I think means... you always have to throw two burst bombs and you splash. Now you can only get like four or five shots out before your tank's almost empty. Yeah, and it nerfs, it nerfs stamper as well. It does nerf stamper and nerfs nozzle nose actually, it nerfs nozzle nose as well. Nozzle nerf? <laughs> nozzle nerf? Oh, nozzle God. nose is no more nose. But... It does nerf the original mini, but they gave it a buff to help. It did, I think that might be in the camera balance for it. That's good. Alright, specials. This is. Please be crab tech nerfs, please. Alright. First one. Ink back. Vac! Increase the radius of the outer perimeter when vacuuming up ink. <gasps> oh, this, this is, is what I wanted! <laughs> this is gonna be scary. 10% large. That's scarier. That is actually pretty scary. <laughs> Maybe. I know this because I've actually tried squib rolling out of the center before when getting over. I barely don't make it. This completely locks that out if you're in the, the epicenter of it now. Okay. Instantly a good change. Tacticaler. Increases the initial s setup speed. So, oh. oh, basically it like deploys faster. Okay. That's cool. And <gasps> thank you, Nintendo. I don't squid roll. Yes. I, don't, I don't bash my head against the tacticaler and still not get a drink now. Thank you. Thank you for that. I can actually, <laughs> I literally squid roll and bonk my big bulbous head against the freaking drinks machine. And it doesn't want to give me a it. Sprite Cranberry, it's so, so dumb. So more, they made it more consistent. Restarter, yes! Okay. okay. Increase the amount of damage from 60 to 70. Nice. Combos now, we have combos everyone. When you throw a fizzy bomb with an aerospray after you use a reslider and it hits an indirect, you will get a kill. And, That's pretty solid, right? And increase the radius. <gasps> It, it, it's support. better, That's... it's better as an aggressive special, and it can combo better. Yay! No longer, no longer splash down 2.0. Oh. Even though it wasn't really that, even though it was like, barely much, even though it was actually, I, I, I scratch that, no, it's actually pretty different to that splash down. Increase the radius of the ink splatter so you can't approach it as well. Dude! Oh! By 21% as well. Oh, okay. It paints well. Ink jet. Increase the radius of the explosion that deals 50 damage by roughly 43%. Okay! So that's solid. That's good. Strengthen the jet of ink that comes out when pressing B, enabling players to jump higher. It goes higher now. Okay, so that is actually oh, that's have, interesting. You have better mobility now, which means you're not going to be shot out of the air more. That's good. Ultra stamp. Increase the radius of the area where the player can be damaged from the shockwaves by forty-three percent. You are that's not safe. That's big. That is a big. In that's a big interest. <gasps> Improve the turning. Yes! We got Kraken. We got Kraken. But what would you even call it? I think I can kind of find Stamp as Kraken, but. Bad. You're. <laughs> bad. It's. 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 Bad. It's, you've, got, you've got the squid, and then you've got. Squidling. <laughs> Improved. Man. And then when doing continuous attacks, the Stamp will now be tra yeah. displayed as translucent. So that means you can actually see things. Good. What's the next one? So it has some sort of thermal <gasps> link effect. Crab and Kraken! Yeah, Crab They're together! Crab and They're changes. probably both nerfed! Okay. Introduce an interval where players cannot attack. Oh, they gave it end for, lag! For, for point for 30 seconds. They gave it end lag. It's not a lot, but it's more end lag. Increase the amount of time it takes for players to act. <gasps> that means it's got the Kraken nerf. So, so it has end lag now. It has end lag and it has a bit of a cooldown between its shield and attack mode. Good. Made it easier for a player to be pushed back by an enemy tower control. Yes, it's a good. Made it made it so a player will drop all their clans. Yeah, <laughs> they use a special in clan woods. So that's specifically talking about um, I call it. That's like if you were to grab yeah. it, like you can't just. So it's, it means it's... that you can pull your crack in towards it, but it's like the other players can still jump to it. It's, like it's better. It's better. Yeah, it's better. It's it will still stop cheese, but it will stop them from doing stuff. It will stop things like just popping a cracker and sneaking into the base and then scoring. It's fair, yeah. Oh, okay. Not to mention that how his, how his mobility was also like mad as well. You could just strafe around the place at the end Ooh. of it. Okay. 
Or Sub- Gambit, what? <laughs> Sub resistance. Damage from burst bombs and fizzy bombs will be reduced more than before, even with just a few gear abilities, so they're nerfing some bombs, basically. God, I hate bombs. Alright. An opening gambit. If a player splats or assists in splatting an enemy while this gear ability is in effect, the effect will now be extended by roughly 15 seconds. What? They just saw the... In- <gasps> that means you get intensify when you have opening gambit. Ooh! Oh! Okay. okay. The effect is equivalent to three primary gear abilities. That means three mains. Oh my god, okay. They've, they've Big buff. Had, they've, had, they've hit Gal hard. Oh god. They <laughs> buffed the carbon. Don't already know scary, why. considering its kit was already pretty solid. They nerfed 96. And I mean, hear... I guess this is good for the sure, the sure bias system, but... You can hear the Kraken better. <laughs> ah! I was like, in the background, just, 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 just but, you know, picture the song, meme in your head where the song just staring at this guy, and just picture 96 means. That's all I think of when I see that. Change to some run. Made the interval between touching a golden egg and being able to use it. It's roughly all the same. Oh, so it's, so it's talking about, I think it's talking about the lag that you get from grabbing yeah. if you're not the host. By adjusting the animation speed when a... Golden thing. egg. Okay, so it's the same. However, if communication delays exceed a certain level of time, it may not be the same. So yeah, it's talking about the delay between the host and the others. So that's interesting how it's been fixed a little bit. That's good. I don't think anyone cares, but that's alright. I care. Some summon run nerd will probably come in the comments and say, No, 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 this is actually great, this is actually great. <laughs> if so, fight me, please. Alright. Um, oh, go- oh my god, there's so many. Well, there's actually not as much, but it's still a lot of like small changes. But no one really cares about them, does it? Um. Apparently. Decoys to fall into, into trees and to telephone poles on Flounder House. What the hell? Who finds this stuff? <laughs> <laughs> Wait, sub weapons to get buried with. I'm not, I'm not even going to go along with it, but Manta Maria apparently gets sub weapons to get buried in terrain. They nerfed it in crap. It p- picks, uh, picks an issue, fixed. fixed an issue where a player using the back while moving forward was attacked from behind. They would sometimes be blocked, so that's a nerf. Um, There's going to be a lot of small things to this. Kraken stuff. I'm looking for any Kraken nerfs. There's apparently a, cra- a, a, a bug with Kraken where if you've hold, held ZR button before changing back to the mobile mode, uh, changing back from your, your shield mode to your tank mode, it started firing a bit faster than usual. Which can't be interesting. Uh, I don't know how, what to say about these patch notes. They're pretty, they're better than before, but they're very interesting ones. None like of them it. are like the only like shooter based buffs where to Nova, and other than that, that's kind of like 96 Gal got a nerf. This has been like a full on like altar of like balanced weapons that are for anything but shooters. Instead of literally just give shooters the middle finger in this patch, <laughs> and I'm all for it. <laughs> Uh, but yeah, overall, this patch, I'm actually really happy with. They fixed- The question is what I was, was going to say about that, that's the question. They fixed Big Swig, they made Big Swig better, let's go, Big Swig boys! Snipe Writer, which is a weapon that I really like, and I'm glad that it's getting better. That's always nice to see. Some of the nerfs, like to the Slusher and the Splat Dooleys were a bit- Not nerf buffs, were a bit questionable. But... It's like- it's like- You've, t- you've got a slice of bread, and you've eaten, like, a point of it with a crust, and you just put it back. Yeah, I don't exactly get it, but fine. You've nibbled a bit. Mini will see a bit more use. Reflex will see a bit more use. Angle Shooter looks like a mini Burst Bomb now. Burst Bomb looks like a mini, uh, Angle Shooter. No, I'm joking. <laughs> I, don't, I, don't know, <laughs> I don't know what Burst Bomb even is at this point. It's Here's the thing, it specifically says with Angle Shirt, it roughly doubles when the terrain hits terrain, so when you hit players, it'll be the same. That's fine. It just makes I mean, it better I mean, that's, as that's, a that's really fun. If it, if, it hit, if it turfed more around you when you hit ang- when you use Angle Shirt when players, that'd be pretty stupid. You're literally given, like, a lot of fun. I mean, yeah, it's anchor Burst Bomb range, but it's, like, basically Burst Bomb at that point when it comes to hitting players. I'm excited to see how big that is. So do you I'm, very, I'm, I'm very... It's just roughly doubled. Bear that mind, double. This is from the one that had this patch. None, and that was after it had its tiny one. None of these special changes am I unhappy with. 
they are all great, especially the buffs. The buffs are actually really needed, aside from... I'm actually kind of funny to see how much crab... Not crab tank, Ultra Stamp's been buffed with its radius. That's going to be scary. I love it. But it needs to be invincible from the front, or just intangible. Because Kraken is intangible. Why is it? Okay, here's the question. Like, you, you, like, people complain about how Reef Slider's got like its invincibility system and all that in front, and say it's not the way to go, but then you're coming here and saying that Ultra Stamp needs invincibility on it. From the front, since Kraken exists now, so like it's only fair. It seems fair, yeah. All right, but at the same, at the same time, okay. Here's a hot, hot take. Maybe it should be that it should be ninety nine point nine percent, and there's a tiny window where you can probably sh or get like a shot through it, but it, only, but it reduces the damage by like ninety percent. So it's, it's like nothing, but you can still get through. So if they're damaged enough, they can still take a, take a bit of damage. Yeah, maybe that could be okay. The gear changes. I don't care. I'm happy. Yeah, yeah. I'm. I'm. I'm not exactly complaining, but the, I'm interested in self resistance. Um, self resistance doesn't really seem much juice, just in general. This Kraken nerf is good. Uh, don't know about the points for special stuff. Salmon run and whatever. Um, I think Salmon's pretty solid now after like the massive change they did to like Big Shot and whatnot. <laughs> For the new special weapon, Kraken Royale, its basic abilities are unchanged, but it's been adjusted in certain modes to reduce unfavorable circumstances. <laughs> yeah, I love it when I'm playing a game all of a sudden I get an eight point lead and all of a sudden it gets diminished to zero. Do you know that's the most unfavorable circumstance? <laughs> Unfavorable, yes, I call it cheat. Uh, unfavorable circumstances, bro. <laughs> oh, I hate unsafe, unfavorable circumstances. Thank you, Nintendo. <laughs> <laughs> Lord, uh, help us. Anyway, what, it, a million times better than the previous patch. It's the that best one we've had by sure. far. But it's all of the I buffs. I don't like Luna Blaster exactly. I don't know why I got buffed, but sure, good job, Luna Blasters. You get to have like. Minor use. That weapon is going to be incredibly scary now. I don't, I, 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 I don't like this. Just means the class blasters are the matter then. That means they're pretty much bringing back Splatoon 1 Luna Blaster. Oh yeah, you said it before that it was bigger than Splatoon 1. Oh crap. I mean, they literally said that. I think they because they brought back a lot of stuff, I think it only makes sense. This is like the returning of specials and... Like change that work. Oh made it no, I'm I can't play tower control anymore. I can't do it. Okay. Anyway, that was that. Thank you all very much for watching. Just a bit of a weird video. Uh, not edited since I want to get this out and I had half an hour to do everything. So yeah. Uh, I hope you enjoyed. Say bye, Moth. <laughs> That's not what I wanted. That's not what I wanted. Bro. There we go.